This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at the spectrochemical series. The spectrochemical series arranges ligands in order of their ability to split d orbitals in an octahedral complex ion. So here we can see the spectrochemical series, which ranges from the iodide ion up to carbon monoxide. As we go from left to right, we have increasing splitting of d orbitals in a central metal ion. Ligands on the left are known as weaker field ligands, and ligands on the right are known as stronger field ligands. In terms of the energy difference between the two sets of d orbitals, weaker field ligands produce a smaller energy difference, and stronger field ligands produce a larger energy difference. A smaller energy difference corresponds to a longer wavelength of light being absorbed and a larger energy difference corresponds to a shorter wavelength of light being absorbed. For example, a complex ion that has weaker field ligands will absorb a longer wavelength of light such as red, and a complex ion that has stronger field ligands will absorb a shorter wavelength of light such as violet. So next we look at some examples. In this example, we'll look at the colors of two solutions of complex ions. The complex ion on the left has six water molecules as ligands, and the complex ion on the right has four ammonia molecules and two water molecules. The solution on the right was produced by adding excess ammonia to the solution on the left. This is known as ligand exchange and is represented by the equation shown. So as we can see, four of the water molecules were replaced by four ammonia molecules. This caused the color of the solution to change from light blue to dark blue. The difference in color is caused by a difference in the wavelength of light absorbed when electrons transition between the two sets of d orbitals. If we look at the spectrochemical series, we can see that ammonia is a stronger field ligand than water. As we saw previously, stronger field ligands produce a larger energy gap between the two sets of d orbitals. This means that the wavelength of light absorbed when an electron transitions from the lower set to the higher set of d orbitals decreases. So to summarize, ammonia is a stronger field ligand. It produces a larger energy difference between the two sets of d orbitals, which means a shorter wavelength of light is absorbed. In the next example, we'll look at another two solutions of complex ions. The complex ion on the left has six water molecules as ligands and the complex ion on the right has six ammonia molecules as ligands. The complex ion on the right was produced by adding excess ammonia to the complex ion on the left. From the equation, we can see that the six water molecules have been replaced by six ammonia molecules. So using the spectrochemical series, we can see that ammonia is a stronger field ligand than water. Therefore, the solution of complex ions on the right will absorb light of a shorter wavelength. We can confirm this using the color wheel. The solution on the left is absorbing orange light and transmitting the complementary color which is blue. And the solution on the right is absorbing yellow light and transmitting the complementary color which is violet. Yellow light has a shorter wavelength than orange light. Therefore, we can see that the complex ion on the right absorbs light of a shorter wavelength than the complex ion on the left. This is because ammonia is a stronger field ligand than water. 